G'day all you beautiful people, I'm Timsima, and welcome back to Jake Coon Story of Legend Time of May. I can't remember, my brain's all scrambled. Um, so yeah, last time we captured a few new minions, had a look at a couple of other ones, filled some empties. This time we're going to capture another couple hopefully. These are a little more dangerous because they're higher level and as you can already see, coated in armor. This here is a turf raid. <clears throat> I don't know if it's a cat or a dog, but it's um quite well armored. How the fuck am I faster than it? Its speed should be about the same. This also hits me a lot harder than I hit it. I'm hitting it for about five or six damage. And those special attacks hit me for twenty. Fortunately, I have healing. It doesn't. Check out the size of that horn, though. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty cool skin. Like, imagine that in a more souped-up kind of graphics, and it um. Got some cool body armor you can put on any minion you merge. Oh, I'm gonna have to fucking heal up. Do you want to hit that one more time? <clears throat> yes, yeah, it brings into the red. Now I'm going to try the old bell and whistle. This is the, uh, should be noted, this is the only earth minion in this forest. Uh, not a huge detail right now. But it, it, it's kind of important. Or is it? Didn't I just say it wasn't important? Oh, I don't fucking know. At least I'm not making up words like rice gum. <sighs> Alright, so over here I believe is, yeah. This is the... Remember I said about those teleporters? Here's the other end. Beetle warp. Cool, so if I stand on that, it'll teleport me. But first, I'm gonna go and check the minion out here, which should have changed now. Yeah. It should be the air element one, the uh, main one. Mudrick. Well, I'd imagine the way it's doing is it's conserving its um, power until its HP gets low, then it's going to start smashing me with those air attacks. Different tactic to the other one who just spams it right out to get a head start. It's, it's minions like this that make you think, you know what, I really, really need protection. <laughs> Alright, um, okay, one more hit, and I should be able to capture it. Got a lot riding on these next couple of turns. Should be an air attack now, I think. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, see that? That was a block. Because I'm apparently faster. I don't see how. But I am. Apparently. Whoop. 
And yeah, so I just caught another one of them. And that is all my fireflies exhausted. So what we're going to do now is we're going to get the fuck out of here because there's we're low on supplies and we've got no cocoons. So just uh, going to skip ahead to Garai's house here. All right, we're back. I just turned off um, magic effects. Um. Maybe not, doesn't really have anything to um, say. That's new. Grant. But hopefully, what I've done will allow me to spin the old cocoons uh, without having to watch the animation. If it's not magic effects, it'll be um, anim animation cut. Anyway, let's have a look at what we got here. So we got the old ones, and then we got another Patable, Patash. It's got a Fang attack, and Agnes, which is a area of effect fire attack. Skaib, which is it's fucking Paddle Chew, okay, except yellow. Then we got Squirt. There it is, Poison Claw. Um, poison. Like if he's got the poison attack, poison attacks will only do one damage and won't actually render them poisoned. Okay. Yeah, look look at this shit. 28 defense. Look look at this shit. This Fang Earth attack. And my drag. Get a get a close look if we can. Look at that shit. That armor is so beast. It's, it's it's like really cool. Like this is a, I know it's an older game and everything, but this is this is it's really cool. All right, so we'll spin the excess. Um, uh, yeah, because we've got like several squids. Sometimes this dash spread is a little different, but I think at the end it all comes down to um yeah, it comes down to just it comes down to just roughly the same at the end. Although I've never reached caps, so that takes some really hardcore grinding, and I don't know why the fuck you'd bother. Because the post game, it's cool for shits and giggles, but it doesn't have a lot of uh you know stuff. I'm just not even thinking right now. Anyhow, um, so let's let's have a look at a few options here. So, say we put um, Squirt skin, like my, my drink skin on Squirt. Let's have a look what we got here. Gain some little legs. Then you get yourself one pointy armored snake. Stuff and nightmares. We go uh, the other way around. Eyeless snake cat. Doesn't really seem to do it much in the way of favors, to be honest. It makes it uh, got a little better magic defense there, but it's um, defense suffers. It's got less HP. It will get that poison attack though, which is a plus. See, we could go for elite metagame kind of thing, where we're just trying to get the best of the best of the best with so with honors. But um, I think something a little more, a little more fun here, just um. Chucking together some minions, trying to get as many abilities on them and how to try and balance them out is probably the best way to go. Um, so I don't know. Um, I'll wait till we get our last minion, the Nushab minion, which is the uh, the only one we haven't gotten in this forest. If I'm not mis forest, forest. I'm not an American. Um, the only thing we haven't gotten in this forest, as far as I'm sure. Well, good luck. 
I'll always Might be time to look at some armor too Problem is a lot of the armor is heavier it provides better defense but less speed which can be a real killer in the wrong moments Uh, first things first, we'll sell the card silk. Go. 1,845. <coughs> we'll, check out, we'll check out the blacksmith and see what um, old dickface has to offer. Weapons, we got a knife, we got a dagger, and we got a bronze sword. Bronze sword, a little more power, a little less speed. It's generally the trade off you're gonna get. I don't think I really need that. Armor with the leather vest or the chainmail vest. Better the protection at the cost of speed. So, I don't know. They both, they both provide their, um, Provide protection, make things a little, a little better, but that that difference in speed could make all the difference against something like a scar wasp. I don't think we overly need to change our equipment at this early in the game, and as it progresses, they will be better. Yeah, fuck off. All right, so now we're gonna cut ahead to the beetle forest. Alrighty, we're back. And here's the chest. Let's check out what that skeleton key is going to offer us. Met a mugwort, shab liquor, and an iron headband. That'll offer a bit of protection. Oh, yeah. I'm going to pay the price for wearing that. Mm hmm. Definitely going to pay the price for wearing that. If I can get something a little lighter, I'll put that on. Ooh, paddle chew. Alrighty, now let's just check out the teleporter. Nifty, huh? And now I'm right near the uh, the checkpoints. Let's see what we got here. Should be a little little cat cunt waiting just for me. All right. Now I'll fight him later because I have bigger. I have some other fish I need to fry right now. I'm gonna need my strength for these fucking new shabs. Oh yeah, look at that beautiful skin. Oh, I didn't heal up before the battle. Oh, that's going to cost me. Here comes the poison. Didn't work. I think I'm going to cover myself to full health. Get a head start on these guys before they uh, fuck me up. Cool, my defense is high enough that I'm shrugging off the poison. Good. That's good news. Hopefully they just go until they run out of MP and then just start attacking. But I believe Nushab... Ooh, this is going really well. Oh, good, good. Okay, that's good. This will work. I was afraid that Nushab um, might play the defense card. I 
could risk attacking it. I might kill it. I might not. I hope not. I did. Alright, cool. Alright, I'm just gonna have to bite the bullet with the next one. It's just, that skin is one of a kind amongst minions. Like, you don't see other minions with that coloration. Vibrant red, brilliant blue. Yeah, I can't let you do that, Star Fox. You're gonna have to try now. And yes, Shab Liquor is made from Pickle Chab Minions. Mm-mm, finger looking good. That should complete my minion collection of this forest. About nine or ten of them. Ring of Venom. Oh, cool. That should... Uh, oh, it's eleven. Uh, should allow me to just cast Venom on my opponents. Like poison. Now, let's see, I might play with this Mardrag a little bit. Alrighty, that'll be it for this video. Um, I may have cut a few bits out here and there because there's shit we've already seen. Um, next episode, I'll be back at Garai's house because I'm going to purify the minions I currently got. Only about four because we're going to look at next time actually adding a minion to the team. I'm probably thinking of fire type. Good place to start. Not a lot of fire in the next forest, so it's always a, always a good idea to have a fire minion on hand. So. Um, yeah, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!